Profit milling is the modern method for high-speed material removal on a CNC machine. This strategy can be found in all of Esprit's rough machining cycles with provisions from two to five axis milling. It yields tremendous tool life. So upwards of 50 times the tool life that you would see in a conventional cycle. And it also greatly reduces cycle time. In the testing we did, we saw an average of a 70% cycle time reduction. The way profit milling works is with a light radio engagement and a full depth of cut. Decreasing the radio engagement of a cutter allows us to increase the feed rate. The cycle then dynamically adjusts that feed rate throughout the cut in order to maintain a proper chip load on the tool. So this increased and optimized feed rate is really a big reason why we're able to achieve such dramatic cycle time reductions. More than a decade ago, high-speed machining was all about taking the largest cut possible with the biggest tool that you could find. What's funny is now we've done a complete 180 from that. So whereas before we were using large tools and taking big cuts, now profit milling can be used with smaller tools and we're taking light radio engagement. This type of cutting can actually be done on a light duty machine. Profit milling has been around for about eight years now. And over that time, we've been able to make several enhancements that make the cycle even better. For example, we've added the profit milling strategy to our four axis rotary cycles. This is something that we didn't do early on, but found that it's, it's very productive and, and works really well. We've also added a maximum tricordial radius field, which allows the user to adjust the width of the tricordial motion within a particular cycle. We've also added bottom-up strategies for our pocketing and Z-level roughing cycles. And we've added a larger initial spiral. So what this means is as the tool enters into a cavity, the first thing you'll see it do is machine a, a fairly large spiral. And what this does is allows for better chip evacuation and better access for coolant entry. Speaking of the entry, we've also optimized the initial channel width and what this does is it allows for faster attainment of the programmed feed rate and fewer machine decelerations. So after doing that type of aggressive cutting, you would expect the, the part and the tool to be very hot. But as you can see, I can, I can touch both the tool and the part and they're, they're not hot at all to the touch. And the reason for that is because the heat is actually evacuated in the chip. So if you're not using this cycle, I really would recommend that you try it. I mean, the benefits have been proven. There's no special licensing or add-ins required. It's available in all of Esprit's rough machining cycles as a strategy. We develop and maintain our own algorithms for this cycle, and we do it better than anybody in the industry.